I need another Wolfgang. Frederick, you have like five cups already. That's enough. What? That's crazy talk. Just give me another. Frederick, you drinking a bunch of Diet Coke isn't going to solve anything. I understand how you feel, but there's nothing we can do. Hey, that's that time of day. Gotta take Wolf Mac out for a walk. Uh, you two have fun, and Wolf Mecca, do not buy any other dogs. Alright, babe, I'll see you in a bit. Have fun, Wendy. <laughs> what? What are you looking at? Since when was this a thing? About, like, two months ago. I was gonna tell you, but you were crying every single day. I'll leave you to mope in peace. Hey, bartender, can I get a Diet Coke? Yeah, sure thing. Hey. Hey, bud. You... Hey. Uh, you feeling all right? Yeah, just, uh... Just a little down, that's all. Wait, hold up. Frederick Fazbear? Yeah, sorry, not doing any autographs at the moment. I'm not in the mood. Oh, come on, man. You don't recognize me? There's over 7 billion people in the world. I don't think I would be able to recognize you if I knew you. Come on, man. It's me, Frankie. Frankie Barrington f from high school, freshman year. Again, for the final time, I don't think I would be able to rec- Wait. Did you say Frankie Barrington? Wait. Frankie? Th that That's really you? Yeah, man, it's me. It's me. Oh my god, I haven't seen you in forever. <laughs> I miss you, man. Anyway, man, how have you been? It's been like 20 years since I've seen you. I've been great. How have you been? It's been forever since I've seen you. Last I saw you, it was like during our summer vacation and and you moved to Nevada. Yeah, and ever since I did that, I missed you ever since. And I never really stopped thinking about you, man. All those fun times we had together, the prom party we did, the carnival we went to. I missed you, man. You know, to be honest, I kind of forgot about you. Yeah, and I kind of understand why. why. You got this whole reputation now about you, you being the leader in Team Fazbear. Anyway, how's that treating for you? Well, it went great for the past 12 years, but... I left the team. Wait, but you're the leader. Then who... What? Don't worry, I gave it to my sister. Oh, I remember her when she was just a little infant. How is she now? She's doing great. I have a feeling that she's taking the leadership pretty well, but, yeah. But what I don't understand is, why did you leave the team? I recently lost my wife. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry to hear that. It was during the robot apocalypse, and we were able to finish it, and she got impaled by a glider, and she died. Ever since then, I... Left the team to protect my daughter. Wait, you guys had a kid? She's adopted. Oh, makes sense. Well, it, it was great seeing you again, Frankie. But I think I'll just... I'll probably stay here for another hour. I just need to get my mind off of everything. You know what? I got an idea. Why don't you just hang out with me for a little bit? Maybe us doing fun activities together. Uh, maybe it'll get your mind off of everything. It'll feel like we're teenagers again, man. Come on. I don't know. I really don't want to, like, hang out with anyone at the moment. I don't want to feel like I'm... <sighs> Never mind. And plus, I don't think Fia would like it. Fine, if you want to waste more money drinking Diet Coke all day, all alone. <sighs> Alright, you talked me into it. Trust me, man. You're not going to regret it. Pretty sweet graphic novel. <laughs> that was the best time of my life. Thank you so much, Frankie. I actually felt like a teen again. 
Yeah, no problem, man. It was my pleasure to help you out. What? Dad? Hmm? Oh, Fia. <laughs> uh, sorry I was gone all day. I was just hanging out with Frankie. She's a really good friend of mine. Uh, Frankie, th this is my daughter, Fia. Hi, Fia. You know, earlier Frederick was telling me everything about you. He said that you're really smart. Thanks for that. Dad, can I talk to you alone for a second? Alone? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, go away by the door, Frankie. Okay. Something wrong, Sertie? Dad, look, I understand that we're both going through rough times, but do you think it's too soon to bring another female into our lives? Sweetie, what do you mean? I mean, like, I don't want anything happening too soon, you know? I mean, we just lost mom. Fia, I understand that you're concerned about not letting go of your mom, but she's gone. There's nothing we can do to bring her back. I'm sorry. And plus, Frankie's just a really good friend of mine. She's not going to replace mom or anything. Don't worry. I would never do that to your mother like that. I just want to make sure that you'll be with the right person too, Dad. I don't want you to feel heartbroken again. I understand, Fia. You're concerned about my emotions as well, but I promise I'll be fine. Plus, hanging out with Frankie again, it felt like I was a teenager again. It felt great. Maybe you should give Frankie a chance. Maybe you'll look up to her. I don't know, Dad. I don't know how I feel about this. Fia, I promise. I would never replace your mom. Never. <sighs> All right. I'll give her a chance. That's my girl. Thank you, sweetie. So, are we gonna watch a movie in your living room, or what's going on, man? Oh, y yeah, sure. You can join us if you want, sweetie. Uh, n no, no thanks. I, I think I'll just continue reading my graphic novel. Alright, I'll set up the movie, and maybe I'll order us some pizza. Alright, man, I'll meet you down in a minute. Hey, Fia. I'm sorry about coming here too early, I guess, but... I, I'm just a friend to Frederick, and... You don't have to trust me if you don't want to, but, like... It's, it's, it's... No, it's fine, really. You go have fun with my dad, just... Try to stay just as friends, please. Oh, y yeah, definitely, y yeah, for sure. <sighs> Mom, I wish you were here right now.